Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And it's first time around for these two countries in the group stage here at the 2023 World Cup. It's France and they take on Jamaica. Well, thanks Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Here's the side France will go with. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And here's how Jamaica will line up. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And the match begins. Useful looking ball. Oh, could be. And a goal. 1 0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. But you have to question the keeper here. It's a good finish, but she shouldn't be beaten inside the near post. She'll be disappointed with that. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Brown, surely! They just couldn't stay in front, and now this match is all square. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Amel Majri, Matteo, good move in the making from France. Can't miss, surely, and it's in! They're back in front, stunning scenes here. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. goal. 
So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Khadija Shaw. There to win it back. Gras Gayoro. And Majri. Kadidja Tujani. Perisse. And begging to be put away. And an open goal. It doesn't get much better than that. And she's found the net. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. Goal. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Khadija Shaw. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Matteo. Sakina Karshawi. France looking dangerous here. A well, disappointing end to the move. Fruitful looking attack. The referee is given a corner. And they're going for the short one. Now what can they do from here? Oh, great attacking play. Must be! And you have to say, she didn't miss by all that much. Yeah, but had it been on target, I don't think the goalkeeper would have been troubled there. Havana Solon. Atlanta Primus. Brown. Promising sequence. Could reduce the deficit. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Well, sloppy in possession. Blackwood. Jody Brown. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Timely intervention. Could be a chance to break here.
Gayoro. Asayi. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? The fans imploring her to shoot. Splendid defending and great opportunity. Oh, and in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger. Otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. And the action underway once more with France very much on top. Brown well they've lost possession of the ball Matteo shielding the ball superbly oh but they've lost it now Well read to win possession back. 15 minutes left for play. Teammates available. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Toletti. Gaioro. Running with the ball confidently. Oh, a good diving save. Well, the short corner routine. Chance to finish. And a good take under duress there. Carter. Jody Brown. This is looking threatening. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Useful looking ball. Oh, could be.